Women CTV with Adam Hinchwood looking ahead to Torquay United at home in the National League South. Adam, how are you feeling going into it? Um, yeah, obviously, um, I think performances have been really good. I'm um, really pleased with the performance the other night. Didn't quite get the result, um, didn't quite get the, the rub of the green, as it were. Um, but yeah, like all in all, I think performances uh, lately have been on a really good level. And um, yeah, it's down to us to, to find that, that standard again. Um, and if we can do that, we know that we'll cause them some problems. And you know, we've got to be... Um, wise enough to know that they've got a lot of quality as well um, so it's going to be a really tough game but you know all we focus on is, is ourselves and um, like I say let's try and maintain our performance level if we can. Second time we've met with them we obviously went at their place earlier in the season winning 3-0 a great day and a day that you were particularly complimentary about the performance what from that would you like to translate over to Saturday? No yeah it was really good like um, away performance um, yeah, we, we, we caused them a lot of problems. They seemed to come man for man and it left a lot of space. Um, we played into our forwards. They held it up really well and were, were a real threat on the day. Um, so, yeah, we've got to have more of the same if we can. But, yeah, like I so, say, um, Gary will, will set his team up. Um, you know, he's a far more experienced um, manager than myself, so I'm sure he'll... Um, you know, have his team ready and prepared, and you know we've got to be ready, ready for that. Um, not so they've got some real good, good players for this, for this uh, standard of football. So yeah, we've got to be uh, wise to what they bring. Um, but yeah, try to focus on on what we can do. Um, but it was a really good performance. Like I said, forward players held up the ball really well, and we've got to look at um, them doing that again for us. Uh, looking at the match day in the whole, it's obviously a big occasion, a big game for us. I think a big crowd, it should be there as well. How big could the support off the pitch be? No, yeah, whenever you know we get a big, big crowd in, um, you know, we do seem to um, put in a good performance. Whether it's, uh, you know, it seems to be an entertaining game anyway. Uh, you know, so yeah, we really hopeful of, of a big crowd, and you know, the fans really get behind us um, here at home and. Um, you know, I'm sure they'll bring a few as well. So, you know, it's got all the makings of a, a really good game here at Woodside, and we're hoping it can be, you know, one um, that all the supporters will enjoy and they want to come back and, and watch the team and support the team again. 100%. Looking at the squad going into Saturday, who's going to be available and who's not? Obviously, Joe Wright took a knock at Tunbridge. How's he getting on? Yeah, he, um, he's had a slight tear to his hamstring, so he's looking at probably four to six weeks um, with that to recover um, so yeah not the best time in the world but you know we timed it well I suppose in Alfie Young coming in um, so you know he's he's come in and, and looked really assured since he's come in uh, I think it's been excellent so um, obviously a big big miss in Joe Rye um, but Alfie comes in um, Nicky Willis had a flare up to um, a slight groin problem um, so he's looking at a similar sort of time scale being out um, and then Greg's got a bit of a problem with his groins as well so you know all three of them are, are very doubtful uh, and a day has just been to see the surgeon today so he's going to need surgery on his knee um, which will probably rule him out for, for the rest of the season so obviously really disappointed for him um, and he's a, he's a great character and he's one that we all want around the place and um, in and around this football club as much as possible um, whilst he's he can't support on the pitch, he'll definitely be there kicking every ball of us off the pitch. Yeah, he definitely will. I think he's such a good character around the place as well that he offers so much off the pitch as well as on it. No, he does, yeah. I think he was um, set up near my family on, on Saturday. Um, I think, um, not Saturday, Tuesday night. I think he was sitting next to Jack and um, they definitely uh, kept my family entertained. I think a few uh, Spanish swear words going at the referee, um, so yeah, no, he's, he kicks every ball, there was the hair alongside and just couldn't believe the sort of passion he sort of showed, even though he's, he's only been with us this season, um, you know, he's fully bought into the club and, um, you know, people like that we want to look after and we want in and around the, the building as much as possible.